Hi everyone, in this video, I would like to introduce our model, Robust Deep Auto Encoder. Our thinking starts at Principal Component Analysis, PCA. There are two models improving PCA in two ways. First, Deep Auto Encoders have shown their success in discovering nonlinear low-dimensional representations. Second, Robust PCA extends PCA that reduces the sensitivity to anomalies. Robust PCA splits a data matrix X into a low-rank matrix L and a sparse matrix S. After splitting, Robust PCA could discover linear low-dimensional representation in L and filter out anomalies in S. Our model, Robust Deep Auto Encoder, is a combination of Robust PCA and the Deep Auto Encoder. It could discover nonlinear manifolds and also detect anomalies. Following the idea of robust PCA, a robust deep auto encoder splits input data into LD and S, where LD is a part of input data that could be well represented by hidden layers of an autoencoder. S contains anomalies which are difficult to be represented. For our experiment, for element-wise noise, as one can see, our input X is heavily corrupted, but robust deep autoencoder could split anomalies to S and the digits in L are cleaner and more easily processed by other algorithms. We recover L without any clean training data. For outlier detection task, we assume each row in a matrix of training data is an instance. If a particular instance is an anomaly, the entire row should be difficult to reconstruct and need to be isolated into S. By applying a group norm on S, we could detect outliers. For example, our nominal data are pictures of digit 4. Outliers are pictures of other digits. Some instances are hard to reconstruct and thus robust deep autoencoders isolate them into S and we consider them as outliers. Thanks for watching.